Design is just transformative in nature, but the reality is you're really transforming someone's life. And I'm so happy to be a part of that. I'm an interior designer based in Toronto. I specialize in interiors, creating really beautiful spaces for my clients. Having the ability to create spaces that will make them feel good really makes me feel good. Okay, we're downtown Toronto today at one of my brand new condos. We just finished construction and we're staging this place, which is my favorite part. We made the living space so much bigger. So the kitchen actually got way bigger. We pushed it out and put all our concealed fridge and freezer here. So this master bedroom is serene. I wanted it to feel so calming. I also wanted to do a little pops of brass in here. This used to all be walled in. So what I did here is that I actually put these cabinets on the outside. I lit them up, like, come on. And then I really wanted to give her a huge shower. And I mean, I'm just really happy with it. How I would describe my design style, I would say is modern, but it also has a lot of elements of traditional design that I hope will be timeless. The biggest thing that I love is clean lines. I'm also an interior designer for TV, so I've worked on a lot of popular home reno shows that you might have seen on air. And now I'm one of the design experts on Canada's number one hit morning show. Here to take us through interior design school is design expert Victoria Tonali. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, so question one is which size rug is correct? When I'm doing these shows, I have to explain to the viewers why am I doing it this way? And then it challenges me as a designer is why am I doing it this way? Could I do it better? So I think for that reason, it's really expanded and made me grow as a designer and also as someone that people can trust. Good interior design can change someone's life. It can change how they wake up in the morning. It can change how they spend time with their family at night. And they're allowing me to be a part of it and allowing me to contribute to it. And I never take that for granted. The next step for me, I really want to be commercial, doing beautiful stores or restaurants and hospitality. I definitely want to think big when it comes to my career. But I think the biggest tip that I'd give is stay true to yourself and never take no for an answer. In this industry, if you don't take risks, you don't have a voice. So taking those risks and really differentiating yourself from the pack and trusting your gut, I think can be very rewarding in this industry. Own the details. <laughs>